what's good with you people? Vortu in your motherfucking house with some Call of Duty Ghost gameplay. And, uh, really, if you're looking for a high score in gameplay right now, this is not what the video you're looking for, so you might as well leave. All I'm going to talk about right now is the sniping in my experience with the MR2B. I think it's, yeah, you see it right there. So, yeah, um, that's it. And I got, like, I think I went 9 and 7. Nothing fucking fancy because... That's kind of what, what I want to talk about. And just hear me out for a second. I like the sniping. So far, with... Well, this is the only gun I use it for. It's the only gun I tried so far. But I like it. Um, It's fun. It's... Because the maps are so big now. Once they get the spawn fix... This game is going to be an arcade shooter battlefield game. Bottom line, that's what this game has turned into. With the map size. Now, when it comes to the DLC, I don't know. I don't know what the reaction of the Call of Duty community will be. If they can implement these patches quickly and they can get the spawns fixed, this game will be fucking amazing. I'm going to tell you right now my opinion. Because, and, oh, 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 I forgot. Don't forget about the dedicated servers. Yeah, you're right. The dedicated servers are very important because the fucking lag is whack. It's right back to Black Ops 2. Because I'm sure they're running the same servers, and I don't, I don't know if they are. I don't know how they're doing it, but something's up. Um, they don't have dedicated servers yet, and that's really why I bought it for the Xbox and not the PS3. So it's kind of a shitty thing for me right now. But uh, it is what it is. The game plays good whenever you're not lagging, and you know how that goes. Um, I don't know about parties. I haven't partied with anyone because I'm kind of get a. I'm trying to get a feel for it, and I don't want no one to rely on me. So I like to do things right now, just go into pub matches alone and play solo. That's what I like to do. And also, I know about the new game mode that Search and Destroy is not on there, and that it's now turned into Search and Rescue. And I played it, and I'm not upset about it. It's a very good game mode. I, if you could go back in my videos, I, I, I upload a lot of Search and Destroy videos because I'm a, I'm a huge Search fan. If if you go back in the videos, you'll see that I said that something needed to change in Search and Destroy. We needed some new structure with it, man. We've been doing the same thing since Modern Warfare, so, you know, why not something new? Just try it. Fuck it. If it don't work, go back to the old one. But, um, you see, I get a couple good kills up in here. Uh, and this guy right here, I'm like, oh, I'm going to fucking get him. And then I was like, oh, somebody must have got him. Uh, where'd he go? Fuck it. So I went somewhere else. I retreated. But anyways, I get some good kills with it. They, they, I'm snipe. If don't call me camping, because I'm really not. I'm patrolling the perimeter. If you notice what I do, I'm carrying two motion detectors, so I can drop one uh, for um, someone else that's patrolling around in my area, and one for myself. Or I could drop two, so I can patrol a bigger area. And it works. It really works. This game, they say that, you know, it's more for the rushers. I disagree. It's more for both. It fits both places. Matter of fact, I think that's where they were stuck with the maps. You can't make a small map the way they got these new perks, man. I got one of my classes. I'm running specialist and assault on the same fucking class. Because all I do is get rid of my secondary weapon and my two tacticals. And bam, I get three more fucking perks. Come on. And I get a gambler perk. So what is up with that, you know? So so you could make us, and I love the squad element. If you notice at the very beginning of the game, it says you're playing as Ian Campbell. That's a good friend of mine that passed away uh, last year, or two years ago, excuse me. And um, what I'm doing is, is uh, every once I unlock everybody in my squad, it's going to be uh, a person that was always close to me that's passed away or... You know, something like that. I thought that'd be cool. Then you could play with people that, you know, passed away so you could feel like you're in the video game with your buddies. It's awesome. Because, like, when I was in squads and I seen Ian Campbell run across me and fucking sniping, I was like, look at my boy right there, Ian, you know, it was fucking cool shit. So that was pretty fun for me. And uh, this game, I like it so far. I can't fucking bitch about it. Like, you know, it's got that Call of Duty feel to it, which we wanted, and it's it, it a lot's changed, you know. And I'm gonna tell you, YouTubers, I can see why they would hate this game, because uh, uh, I don't think we're gonna um and let, cause see the the big thing about YouTube is is like they use the UAV to their advantage. The UAV is not as good on this as it's been in other past Call of Duties, in my opinion, um because they got the new tag thing they do. 
I know there was other ways to tag, but it showed up on the radar more than it did on the map. So, like, when you tag somebody with recon, um, uh, you could see them across the fucking map glowing, man. Like, you know, their body outlines. So, that's pretty fucking cool, you know. And I guess this is more of my thorough review than last time because I got to play it a lot more. And I, I, I appreciate the game and what they're trying to bring to it. It don't seem like it's more generated towards the kids anymore. It really don't. It seems like you have to really think about what you're wanting to put together instead of... Because, see, Black Ops 2 was simplified. It was like loadouts for dummies. At first, it looked like it was really complicated, but it's not. Because, see, what a lot of these guys would do is go boost, and they could get any kind of fucking load. You saw that ball tap. That guy I just had to point that out. You could get any kind of loadout that you want, but um, with this, you had to get squad points, and you had to really earn shit to get what you want. So, I think that's pretty cool. Or you don't have to earn much, and you can unlock shit that you want early, you know, and just want to use one particular gun. That's fine, too, so... I don't, um, I wonder if anybody's prestige yet. That's possible. You'd be surprised, man. You'd be surprised. I looked at the leaderboards before, and there's two two or three hackers, one, two, and three for Xbox. That's funny. Hackers are right. Their kill-death ratio is like 0. 0.000, right? And, but they got like 2 million kills and zero deaths. It's like, what the fuck? Like, it looks fucked up. <laughs> but it's funny to me. Anyways, I don't know. I like the sniper in the game. I haven't been killed by quick soapers. I did go into a fucking lobby and there was motherfuckers doing 360s. And see, that's what I'm talking about right there. See how you saw him through the rocks? That's it. Kind of confused me right there. But he was on the other side, and I was like, "Oh, that's fucking cool." That kind of was like, "I could look, see right here," and then somebody killed him right then, right here. And I was like, "Oh man, that was gonna be an easy kill." Anyways, and uh. Yeah, so this game, you know, it can be really fast paced or you can make it really slow paced, you know, so because the maps are so the only thing I noticed that I kind of don't like about the maps is there is no way to retreat really, man. Like once someone sees you, you're fucking dead, like right fucking then, you know, and you can't do anything about bam, you're dead. If they get the fucking even if you get the one up on them, it seems like it's just like bam, dead instantly. So I. You know, they need to fix the health. I don't know what's up with that, but anyways. Yeah, so the sniping so far is good. I don't know how they're going to patch it. Don't know if people will exploit shit, but you know the deal. Lord, to win your motherfucking house, like a motherfucking boss. Holla at your boy.